center. Mike Butcher will drop and give us 50. Mike. Hey, good morning, Ed. Good morning, everyone. I will give you 50 here in just a little bit. Roxy joins us now. Roxy Marmaduke, good morning to you. Good morning to you. Okay, so you have a tool. What do you call this? Yes, this is the BOSU. It stands for Bosu. both sides up. <laughs> so you okay. can, like, flip it. Basically. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. I've seen these at the gym. I've seen people working on them. There's so many different ways that you can use these yeah, to work really out. Are. What is so great about this? Why is it a good tool to use to work out with? I love the BOSU because it really jazzes up your old workout routine. So you can take that same old workout routine that you've been doing, mm -hmm. jazz it up, make it harder, work those stabilizer muscles, and really burn more calories. Because instead of doing just a regular push ups on the yeah. ground, you can do it on this, and yeah. you have to stabilize like too, so you get those little slow, the fast twitch muscles going. Yeah, right. exactly. Exactly. Perfect. Okay, so show us some exercises. What okay. do we have going on today? So the first one I want to show you here is a push-up. Okay. So you can do this, you know, on the BOSU, off the BOSU, but we'll do this here on the BOSU. I have my knees on the ground for a little bit of a modification, and you can see it kind of shake as we go down and up. So you're doing the more advanced version there, which is really good. This will really that, does, that is different because you do have to keep this stable. I know. Now another good one here is you can actually turn it to the side and then go back to the side and oh, go wow. to another push-up. So the way you're doing it is so much harder, Mike. You're doing awesome. <laughs> well, you know. So, <laughs> so this one is so great for all those muscles and like the chest, your abs. Can you feel it in your abs? Oh, like yeah. contracting? <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, okay. Well, that's good. So this one we flip over. So that's both sides up. We're going to do a bridge on here. So you can do the same thing with your feet on the ground if it's a little bit too much. You scoot your butt up really close to the BOSU, feet on top of the BOSU, lift up those hips, and you hold. Really engages those hips, especially the gluteus maximus, gluteus medius. Engages the hamstrings. Great for the abs, great for the back. You could also make it a lot harder by lifting one leg up. So, I mean, even just doing the regular bridge itself, so you just hold. it's hard enough. Yeah, you just hold it, and that's all you have to do. <laughs> so, you know, some people think that you have to go fast, you have to go hard to get a great yeah, workout. No. All you have to do here is really hold it. And, and you switch, feel, of course. Yeah, and you switch sides. You feel a lot of work there, just all through the whole back side of the body. And, you know, these are the same exercises. You can go ahead and put both feet down. These are some of the same exercises I do with my personal training clients. You do? Okay. Yeah. Very yeah. cool. So, what else can we do with this thing? We have one minute left. Okay, cool. Well, one foot on, one foot off, BOSU squats. So this makes it a lot harder, getting that butt back. You this on the top okay. You're going to feel it a lot in that right hip. You're going to feel it shake. You're going to feel the peroneus muscles here on the side. We'll really give a good shake here. It's going to be kind of hard to do. So if you don't have a BOSU, I know he's a trooper, right? <laughs> if you don't have a BOSU, though, all you have to do is put your foot on a stair, or okay. you can just do regular squats. Okay, that's a good idea. So you obviously switch sides. You can do a lot of different things on the BOSU. And you can hear, like, I'm out of breath. <laughs> Gets your heart rate up. Yeah. It's a great exercise, a great tool to have. We have 30 seconds. You want to show us one more? Yeah, exercise? sure. We'll do a plie on here as well. This one this we're like going to... thing. <laughs> I know. You'll just turn the feet yeah. out. Tuck those hips under. Take it down and up. So and what does this do differently than doing a squat? Oh, this one works the inner thighs a lot more. Okay. So the squat is going to be working on the leg muscles, but this will really get the inner thighs. Yeah, exactly. yeah. So for all those ladies who have inner thigh issues, this is great for them. You don't have to just go to that machine and just go like this. No, and you know what? <laughs> These exercises are so much better than using the machines because it's working all those stabilizer muscles. More calories, more bang for your buck. I mean, are you kidding me? <laughs> Training. Yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. Yes, that's the teacher. Okay, we're back with more after this. Stick around. Thank you.